Are we, Sandra? Back at the nursery. Left for you by 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 a visitor. So I promised I promised you that I would give that to. It Sandra. always rains on Bank Holiday weekends, doesn't it? So we cool. So which side of the galleries do you want? I didn't get to bed till almost four o'clock this morning and I am shattered, really tired. Uh, I might go into a little bit of detail about something that happened last night at the nurseries. Don't worry, everything, everything's fine. Um, but I might not, I'm not really too sure. But at the moment, I'm giving Russia a walk. Um, it's Saturday. Oh, we're on the Spring Bank holiday weekend. Uh, I had a message off Sandra. She's going to be setting off soon. And she'll be up here, fingers crossed, early afternoon. Rashi, have you had enough? Come on then. She said, Rashi just doesn't like going on walks anymore. Uh, but yeah, um, quite a, a lively night. All I can say is I survived. Um, yeah, a very uh, unusual incident happened. <laughs> Fortunately, it, it didn't affect the, the main campsite or anything. Right, as I say, I need to get the dog walked and go on there and get today started. <sighs> it's, it's, it's one of those days. I can't put fully on, on camera what's, what, what's been going on uh, in the last 24 hours, but it's been... Um, a little bit lively is probably the best way to describe it. Always a drama at the nurseries, isn't there? Um, <laughs> always a drama. Uh, so just had a message off Sandra. Um, she's currently about an hour and a half-ish away from here. Um, I'm hoping to be able to get over this afternoon and go and say hello and probably get um, a bit of a catch-up off Sandra. We need to get some tea cut. Um and things like that. And obviously, I've not been back at the bungalow since the electrical work uh, was finished. Um, so I think our electrician was in this morning. Um, so yeah, uh, not, not a lot of filming going on here at the nurseries today because we're busy in touring. Obviously, I'm not firing up any machinery. Well, what have I had? Oh, uh, camping chairs. Yeah, somebody's just been in and said, oh, do we sell camping chairs? Uh, apparently his chair collapsed. I said, no, but I've got a spare one you can have. So we had one that's been in the um, in the mower shed for it's probably a couple of years. So a happy camper with a new camping chair. That makes me it's happy. Here. Hello. <laughs> okay, it's raining and it's not bin day. It's Saturday. But you know what? If you come to Britain and it's a bank holiday weekend, it always rains on bank holiday weekends, doesn't it? So we're currently got drizzle and tomorrow <laughs> allegedly we've got potential thunderstorms on the way um, so we've got a couple of pitches we've got a mystery no-show pitch number one and I think a total of five pitches where they should be occupied and they're not um, but I'll just go quick 360 if you've never stayed here before so all the hard standings around the outside done say camping 18, no show. Regular there in the van over there. He just bought some goodies, having a beer. Uh, another camping pitch, and camping pitches down there. And then the tent pitches are all booked, apart from one. Um, and that, that's been a cancellation as well. So, ah, beautiful day. Look at that lovely grey sky. You, you just cannot get any, any more British than a grey sky on a bank holiday. Beautiful. Nice bird song. Right, apparently as I'm recording this now, Sandra is an hour away. Um, fingers crossed she'll get there safely. Get there, meaning to the bungalow safely. Hello, Russia! How are you? Oh, it's really fun I've seen you since this morning. Now then, what have we got here? So we've got these doggy donuts. Now oh, you like these here, don't they? 
Doggy donuts, Russia. Oh, I have two. Where are you, Sandra? I was happy, but I've got a bit, a bit of a headache now because I've been talked at for half an hour at least. Go on. I've had three, three hours sleep. You can tell. <laughs> are you impressed by the electrics? You've got, you got two plug sockets of your own in the garage. I'm not very happy about that. You will be. You got an idea? Yeah, so it's got six sockets. It's only given me two sockets. What you no, like? four sockets. You can. How can you, you four sockets? You, you can have the freezer and the dryer. No, 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 side. no. We'll plug them into yours. No, no chance. All right. So today's Saturday. It's getting on. Uh, our electrician still got work that he's finishing because he's going. Um, well, he's worked hard. He's done a good job. Yeah, no. It's just, uh, it's, uh, it's just a relief to know it's now done properly and safe. Yeah, so we've it's got important. we've got a big a big a big bill. Um, so because I've missed you so much, Sandra, I bought you that. Yeah, just, just grab all the oops. So the electric's going on and off. There you are, Sandra. How was that for you? Just just for you. You really bought it. <laughs> I'm not sure I believe that. <laughs> I've forgotten the I've forgotten the name, but it was left for you by 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 a visitor. So I promise I. Promised you that I would give that to Sandra. Um, Thank you, whoever you are, anyway. <laughs> they, they, they stayed in the van and um, they stayed with us for an extra night. They were on the, on the nurseries for a week, so that's that. Um, and look what else I bought you. Oh, Sandra, you've got no idea how lucky you are to have me. Look at that, look at that there. Ooh. What is it? It's the cream scum. I'm, I'm the... I don't really believe you bought it, but it looks amazing. Thank you. Oh, it was. <laughs> right, I, I, I think it's Mr. Jordan. I could rubbish on names, but you know who you are. Um, he's staying with us for the bank holiday weekend, so he's bought that. And I said, Sa amazing. Sandra will like that. I do. Thank you so much. Um, oh, Sandra, Sandra, I got you. I got you something else as well, Sandra. Okay. Got no idea. Not got a clue. Mm, so I did. I had a bit. I bought a bit of a bacon barn cake this morning, but. So the person who bought the creams, sorry, no, no, I bought this, and that's for you for tomorrow to, to graze on. A proper bakery sausage roll. Right. So the same person I bought that bought that. Nice. And Wonderful. then he's also just so she's not left out. Oh wait, wait where are you, Rash? Um, so Rash, Rash is in here. Um, we've got Rash's snacks. Nice. And so you need sweeping up. And we've now got uh, a plug socket in the corner here, uh, which wasn't here. So I had a, I've had my little computer desk there. It's been over there, Sandra, in, in that little corner. So I can get myself into there. How about that? Great. Uh, how was your journey over? It was fine. Yeah, it's it's all, all OK? Went pretty smoothly. I've, I've had 20... <laughs> I've, no, no, I'm not 24 hours. I've had 12 hours of dramas, non-stop dramas. I'm so, so tired, incredibly tired. Um, uh, for one, I did actually sleep quite well last night. So I woke up at seven because I normally have to get up really early. But I thought, no, no, no. So I didn't actually get up and I managed to sleep till nine in the end. So that helps. Just I need to get the next week out of the way. And all being well, the plastering will be done Wednesday, decorated by the end of the week. And then you'll be coming. How, how, how many days have you got left to work now? What day are we on? How many days left not you've done? What well, days left or days to work? It's not quite so. Okay, so I'm tired. what day is it? Saturday? Saturday today. Including today? So you're not working today. You, you've got Monday off, it's a bank holiday. Seven days. Seven working days to go. No, seven days in total. A week? <laughs> I still don't understand. Three working days, seven actual days to go. Yes, yeah, so that's like a week. Seven days is a week. I call I call seven days a week. <laughs> do, do you? <laughs> those are certain. It's those are, what, what do you call you seven said, days? You said how many days to go? Well, you, you, you got a week. A week to go. <laughs> those are certain days. There's a, there's a Beatles song like that, isn't it? Was it eight days a week? Eight, eight days, days a week. A week. Da, 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 that's what day. it feels like at the moment. Yeah. So this time next. So Friday, so you finish on Friday coming up? Yeah, so I've got, got my leaving party on Friday. <laughs> this is why I'm not travelling on Saturday. I'm having a day off. I'm going to go right. into town, have a nice day off and come over on Sunday. Okay. 
So for the next couple of days, you can just help me clear some of the electrical chaos and a bit of hoovering and stuff put away. And then when you come up on the Sunday, all being well, things will be decorated and plastered. We need to get some wallpaper. Yeah. Are you happy with the progress? Of course. And how's your garden? I'm sure it's amazing, but I'm just a bit gutted I've missed so much already. It's like peak season for the garden and I've been stuck in Manchester. No, it's, but we've, you've got well, them p p things coming up, see? Lilies? No. Lupins. Lupins, lupins. We've got, lup we've got lupins. 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 Lupins are beautiful. Lilies. Yeah, yeah. well, yeah, lily, lilies always remind me of death. Not, not white lilies. Oh, yeah. Tiger lilies. Well, them lilies have when when people die, and you go into the crematorium, you can smell the lilies. Oh, that's, that's white lilies. I know, but that's, they smell these, of death. These, these are tiger. Yeah, but these are tiger lilies, not white lilies. What's the, what, what's the difference? Different colour. Did it smell the same? I don't know. We'll find out. Well, I know because they smell of death. You go into a florist, you smell lilies, and it's just like oh. You sound like my mum now. <laughs> Does your mum have not like lilies? No, she had a major strop. When my dad died, because they put lilies in the, the coffin arrangement. Yeah, don't put lilies said, no, anywhere no, near me. Take them off, Whoa. take them off. You're, you're having a direct. I need to have a chat with your mum. Um, <laughs> anyway. So, yeah, so... so yeah, so, yeah, whenever mum goes, don't give her lilies. No, no so... Um, so, this room here... Sorry, th those that have been following will know. That's been changed. Those have been changed. That's been changed. Unfortunately, very little damage or carnage in here. There's just brick dust because that's come through the hole. Come on, let's go through and give a quick. Right, you stay there, Russia. Um, Russia. So I'm trying to rec recollect, recollect what's going on, Pete. Shut the front door because the dog came out. Uh, right. right. That's labelled. That's labelled. We're just going to start cleaning up there. That'll do for us. Okay. If it was Carly, would it be black labelled? <laughs> Pete, the Pete, electrician, smashing guy. Um, if you need his details, he live local. Um, get in touch. Um, so, so is the electric on? Just trying. I don't know whether I'm not seeing anything lit up. Labelling up. Okay, right. So we've now got spotlights, LEDs. The thing's been done. That's been replaced up there so the bed's in a silly spot at the moment but it's just going to live with that um that's been done um and then your mum's room down here oh those were ended up wrong so that's now got a twin socket on it that wasn't there and now so a bit of conduit and then we've now got another twin socket has gone in here but because this has had to be replaced, this old unit, which we said we weren't too sure what was going to happen, part of that's had to be taken down. So apparently it's so that you can switch it on either by the bed or by the... Yeah, so same as our bedroom, we've got a main light on, on it. Uh, so if I was in here, um, and then obviously with it channeling all the rest of it, so that now turns these... Oh, so these, these are all new, and then there's... Another ones are down here. Uh, so Lewis is doing some stuff here. Then this is just being finished off in hither, um, which has come down with a massive conduit down, down, down and into here. And then uh, we'll go out the front door, Sandra. So you've got your nice new outdoor. So that's a twist with the water seal on it in here. Connector. And then Sandra, you've got two plug sockets there, Sandra. Look, Sandra's complaining how many plug sockets she's got. And then Sandra's got two plug sockets there. So this is the new other main fuse box in. Because right when it's a nice sunny day, as you've come this way here, when it's a nice sunny day and you want to be weaving on your weavy thing, you can come in and come sit out here in the, in, in the sunshine. Got the back, back of your head. And then I've got my, my plug sockets, my man sockets. I've got these. Oh, you can have them as well. Unfortunately, they're used. Uh, and then on my side of the um, garage, I've got a couple of plug sockets down there. So I think we're going to have a jukebox and fruit machine in there. And then I've got my other plug sockets, my other plug sockets. Um, hang on, no, no, that's the new light here. Sorry. And I've got my workbench is going to go here. Um, 
and I've got my plug sockets here for my beer fridge and my, and my beer pump, a pool table here, then we'll have a dartboard here. Um, are you not impressed, Sandra? No. no. Which side of the gallery do you want? People are looking at the back of your head. There is another way around. Uh, no, hang on. I, I'll, ex I'll explain around. why. Hang on a moment. So, which side of the galleries do you want? I just don't know why you couldn't have just done it equitably, dear. It is equitably. Really? Right, and then, so then in the back of the house now, we've also got. Uh, so, Rush is outside barking. She doesn't realise we're in here. Um, another hook up points, and then, so the spare bedroom, in inverted commas. Um, that's all been done as well, so a lot of work. You're looking forward to getting the garage emptied? Well, not really, because there's nowhere for it to go at the moment. Oh, I've got plans. No. I've got just, plans. Leave it, leave it with no, me. No, because, like, just to be fair, I, for three months, I have not been in a position to do anything at all. And then you're going to be like ants in your pants, even though I've been absolutely stuck in limbo for three months, just calm. Chill, give us a month. Just give it a month. Don't rush, please. I can't Just. rush because I've, I've got. But got, well, you're a lady of leisure. I've got to work. Leisure. You're giving, you're giving up work. I still got paid to work. work. Well, paid work. There's loads to do. What's to do? There's still no way to put anything. Right, anyway, this is all, and um, this can all go back over the next couple of days on my days off. Um, to go in. The, the house via the back door. Pull oh, in. Back at the nurseries. Well, in Mumbai, in Lincolnshire. Right, we just we just had a good good catch up with Dave and Tracy, haven't we? And a brew. Lovely couple. Very welcome cup of tea as well. <laughs> Been bedlam this afternoon, yeah. hasn't it? I'm so incredibly tired and it's really pressing on uh, and mm -hmm. everything like that. So I've no idea how long we've got footage wise, but I'm sure we've got enough to make a vlog out of this. So do you want to say Goodbye, Sandra. Oh, no, 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 I'm going to Russia. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Peter, Peter, Peter Webster. He sends some super thanks. He's been commenting about you and everything. So, right. give Peter a thanks. Hi, Peter. Thanks. What, um, what, 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 what are you waving? It's a dog treat for Russia. <laughs> I said it's not for Peter. Russia. It's good. Right, right, just. Biscuit. Sandra's in Sandra land currently. So, Peter Webster. You went to film Russia. Oh, right. right. There, there, there you go. So uh, thank you for the uh, super thanks, Peter. And like everybody that comments, we read all the comments. Sandra does try and keep up with them the best that you can. And uh, we appreciate that, don't we? Yeah, I'm still working my notice, but I do try and read things when I can. So yeah, appreciate all the interaction. That's just really great. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. So all being well, soon. another just over a week when you watch this, you'll be seeing Sandra probably in a little bit more content. Do, 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 do. Say, say to Sandra. Sarah. Mm -hmm.